More big changes to abortion access here in Iowa and across the country. Here's what abortion access stands in Iowa. It's banned after 20 weeks unless the mother's life is in danger or in the case of rape or incest. A new law could have taken effect today, but didn't. Chief investigative reporter James Stratton explains for us tonight. James and Stephen Ray, it popped up behind you. It has been 21 days. It has come down to the wire on the 21st day today. Still, a 24 hour wait for an abortion is not law in Iowa, but it could be in the coming days. The state Supreme Court has yet to issue what's called a procedendo that sends the case from them back to Johnson County, where it was originally heard. Once that happens, it will become law, according to the Iowa Attorney General's office. Today is the first day the court could issue the ruling, but it has no obligation to do that today. Courts closed at 430. It's not going to today. It is important to note the court has already issued a ruling saying abortion is not a protected right in the state constitution. Three weeks ago, it reversed the 2018 ruling, which held up the 24 hour law until the court ruled on it. Now, if you're confused with the back and forth on all of this, you're not alone. Right now, abortion is legal in the state of Iowa. Planned Parenthood declined an interview on the subject until the law takes effect. Right now, it already has a 24 hour wait on abortions in the state here. The governor's office also declined our request for an interview regarding that 24 hour law today. Steve. Thank you, James. We do want to clarify how we gathered information to initially determine the ruling would become law today. The Iowa Supreme Court reversed its 2018 ruling on June 17th. Then on June 22nd, we asked the Iowa Attorney General's office for clarification on when the 24 hour waiting period would go into effect. The AG's office told KCCI the ruling isn't considered final until the case moves from the Supreme Court to district court. The attorney general's office said that would happen 21 days after the ruling, which is today, July 8th. Today, the AG's office gave us new information saying today is the earliest the case could move back to the district court, but it's not a deadline. As James just reported, the 24 hour waiting period is not law until the case is returned to the lower court, according to the attorney general's office. We'll let you know when that happens and when the ruling becomes Iowa law. Once again, abortions are still legal in Iowa.